What's up, Trelawney? Ah, there you are, dear boy. Yes, here I am. Here I am, once again. I'm torn into pieces. You can't play at the tables on a Lanahassee River boat looking like this. Not if you want to fit in so well, no one realizes you're there to rob the place. Now, come on. What are you talking about? That suit is not fit for the purpose at hand. Come on. Man, I got all dressed up. Come on, let's take you to the barber. Uh, my hair is fine. My hair looks really nice. I look very put together. Pop your chest out. Get outside yourself. Yeah, all right, all right. Sing to be or not to be. Let's play poker. Good evening, gentlemen. Arthur Keller. Sorry. <laughs> Evening. Not to worry. Welcome to the game, Mr. Callahan. Okay, gentlemen, let's play. I hope you're a player. Been too many cowards at these tables recently. Nothing less dignified than a man afraid to lose a little money. Well, Mr. Blythe wins with three queens. Ooh, wow. <laughs> Goodbye, gentlemen. I man, he just... It's just you and me now, friend. Yes, it is. He took out That's three players in one turn. The man you seem to think you are. I don't even know what my hand is. I have... Sorry to do this to you, but I have no choice. All in. Call. Yeah, I'll call you. Interesting. Very cowgirls. All right. King, three. What's up, idiot? Shit. Shit. I guess my luck held. Is that you done? Done. Bust. Or, uh, you got something else to play with. Meaning... Well, I heard... Well, I heard there were some big boys on this boat. Maybe that's not you. No offense. Sit your hillbilly ass down. Oh. Why, I got a watch. Look at you. An expensive one. Real fine. Ooh. Swiss. Nice. A Reutlinger, no less. Reutlinger. It's safe upstairs. It's worth more than you. Let's not waste any more time here. All in. Don't worry, sir. Everyone is the author of his own good fortune. Well, nothing ventured, nothing gained. Okay. Pear cake. Very good, but not good enough. Shit. What do we got? Oh, he's got three aces. Uh -oh. Mr. Blythe. Mr. Callahan wins with an ace high diamond flush. Oh, I have a flush. Damn you. Nice. I didn't realize. No offense. None taken. Don't reach for that gun. Take his gun, Arthur. I'll take this. Thank you. Like I told it, I told you it was going to become mine. I missed. Oh, I, I. Thankfully, they gave me enough time. There he is. Now, don't be a sore loser, friends. Something I don't like about the pair of you. There's plenty I don't like about you, but I have the good manners to keep my mouth shut. Jesus Christ. Oh, well. Oh, I almost shot Javier. Can't do that. Good night, sweet prince. Hello. This is why I play the game. Oh my gosh. I don't know where to go. I'm almost dead. Oh gosh. I don't have my satchel. Yeet. We're just gonna pretend the alligators don't exist. Well, never a dull moment. Yeah, that's one way of putting it. So, how much did we get? A few thousand, I think. Pretty good. Yes, indeed. And this watch. 
Uh, apparently it's worth a bunch. Uh, Swiss, uh, a Reutlinger or something? Nice watch. Yes, it's a Reutlinger, all right. <laughs> we'll give it back then. All right, <laughs> come on, let's get out of here. Well, let's go do the Sadie mission. Sadie's fun. I like Sadie. She's got a smoker's voice, but like that's okay. So does Arthur. I like Arthur. Crazy. I am crazy. I like the gunfighting. I just I don't like all these stealth and you know high society missions. I want to be a cowboy, not a white collar criminal. Except I want to be a cowboy with a supercar, not a horse. Hell, I take like an ATV or a motorcycle. Is it just you and me? No, we'll need one more, I reckon. I say Lenny, not Micah. Well, that depends if you want a massacre or a beta. You know, I wish that there was something I could do to make the two of you get along better. Micah's a I fucking see. idiot. Make him change. Very funny. What is that? Oh. Well, they killed him. Awesome. Great. Exactly what I needed. Oh my gosh, dude. That was fucked up. That was fucked up that they killed Karen like that. It took a second to prop to, like... Hit me! They chopped him off! They chopped his head off and sent his horse back into the camp! Come on, reload your fucking gun, Arthur! Jesus Christ. You're the worst cowboy ever, Arthur. Good night. Oh, you thought, idiot. We're not getting overwhelmed. I'm not overwhelmed at all. I'm very comfortable. Oh gosh, now we are overwhelmed. Ah! I'm being shot! Ow! I couldn't move! It'd be nice if anybody else helped. Christ, dude. I'm not let, 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 letting Sadie go. Jesus Christ, I can't talk. Oh my god, she cut his throat and then shot him. Nice job, Sadie. <laughs> yeah, Sadie. Oh, Sadie, you're such a badass. Poor Kieran. Uh, poor kid. Man, that was Mr. fucked Swanson, up. Did you take this boy and bury him someplace near, but not too near? Of course. Charles, help me with the box. We need to get this place cleaned up. Mr. Pearson, Miss Grimshaw. Already taking care of it. Come on now, work. Como Driscoll. That man. <laughs> oh my god, Jose is just carrying the head. So can I, Arthur. So can I. We need to get moving. Away from here. So we should start looking for another camp. You ain't thinking big enough, Arthur. You ain't seeing the vastness of our problems and our opportunities. I'm not sure I get you. You will, son. You will. Meet me near the trolley station. We got work. Jesus. Shall we? Yep. Let's go, John. Fucking no Driscolls, man. They followed us all the way to Lemoyne. I'm gonna kill the shit out of everybody.